Hi everyone, hope you're okay. My name's Elizabeth and I'm from Quality Estate Agents. And what I'm going to be doing over the course of the next nine weeks, each week I'm going to be giving you a reason why your property might not be selling. So if you've been sitting on the market for, I would have said over three months, but now I'm saying over two months, then there's definitely a problem. Houses are selling very quickly at the moment. Um, so there's no reason to be fair why your property should be sitting on the market even more than one month. So every week I'm going to just give a few examples, a few ideas of, of why your property could be one of those few that are still on the market. So the first one this week is pictures. Now I see quite a lot of times when I'm looking on right moving Zooplet and I'm looking at properties uh, that I find properties for comparables or finding rentals for landlords and uh, I see a lot of shoddy pictures you know, they're dark, they're blurry, they're not clear. It's really, really, uh, it's very, very uh, crucial that you get your pictures perfect. This is what people are seeing. This is how you're presenting your home. You know, we give everyone out a brochure, which explains to everyone what they can do to their property to make it photograph ready. We also employ the services of a professional photographer I myself aren't trained in taking photos. I'm trained in selling houses. Taking photos is not my forte. That's why we, we employ a professional photographer to come in and take professional photos. He will then go back and edit all of those photos out and send them across to me and I'll pick out the best ones. So it's very, very crucial that your photos are great. Like I said, it's the first thing people see when they're looking to see your house. You know, the main picture, that's how you're presenting your house. In my opinion, it's got to be like a show home. If it's if if your house is a bit cluttered, then you move remove that clutter out, out of the way. Uh, we have on the odd occasion when the house has been a bit cluttered and they haven't moved removed the clutter or it's been too get difficult to do that. We've photoshopped a lot of the clutter out of the room. Uh, for example, all your herbs and spices on your kitchen side, we photoshopped that out of the kitchen. Another example is what we've done is in the past when we had a property that was on the market and it was empty, so no furniture. And what we did is we got the Photoshop company to Photoshop the furniture in. in. So we had oh, the living room, had you know, sofa, coffee table, the dining room had a dining dining table and chairs. Conservatory had a couple of chairs and tables, which was nice. And we sold that for over the asking price. Now, I guarantee, categorically tell you that that only sold because it had been virtually staged. Because before we did that, we, we had it on the market and it was also on with another two agents and nothing. It was on over the market. It was on the market for over three months. He then came back to us after a month and said, can you try again, just using yourselves this time? And we said, OK, let's let, let's try a different um, avenue. Let, let's let's try something different. And that's what we did. We um, put the furniture in and yeah, it's all for over the asking price. So, yeah, that's number one for this week. Pictures, absolutely crucial to get your pictures perfect. If you're not happy with your pictures, get your agent over to to do them again at the end of the day you're paying for this service if, if you're sitting there and you think your pictures could do with improving then give your agent a call and and have a chat with them and say you know can you come round and take the photos again so yeah that's all for now and i'll see you next week for the second reason why your property might not be selling see you next week thank you bye